Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. Our next guest showcased her acting chops as the first transgender actress to portray a trans character on Fox's Star. And now she's using her influence to bring about change in the National United We Stand campaign. Mm -hmm. Please welcome back to our show the beautiful and talented Amaya Scott. Woo! Yes, she better come through. Oh, no, always. I gotta say always. something. Go ahead, go ahead. I can't cry. help myself with this hair, honey. Yes. Yes. What is it giving? Because it's you. pride. It is pride. Yes. 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 So I love that. But and, and then for my book, Memoirs of a Mermaid. Yes. yes. So yes. I wanted to bring out the mermaid hair today. I love yes. that. Yes. It's cute. It is so gorgeous. cute. We're going to get into all that, but we're going to just step back just a couple of steps. Yes. Okay. Yes. Because a lot of us are just really bummed about Star. Mm -hmm. Now, yeah. <clears throat> What was your response when you found out it wasn't coming back, or is it coming back? Do you have some tea? Got some tea? Got some tea? Got some tea? So of course I was sad at first. Of I, course. I, I'm like I feel like it happened unexpectedly. Mm -hmm. Um, I really don't know at this point to be honest. Like Lee has said that he's working on some things. And, and then he said we should kind of just give up hoping. <gasps> and then he turned back around recently and said that there may still be oh, some hope. hope there. Yeah. yeah. This show was amazing, though. Yeah. Well, thank you so much. Mm -hmm. I know that if they ever, you know what I mean, call, then I'm always ready yeah. to be cotton. But we just have to, you know, see how it goes. Yeah. But there are other projects out there that yes. I'm sure you'll be great at. Yes, and I just landed a new project. So I can only talk about a few things because it's in the beginning stages, but mm -hmm. I did get an offer for it. It's mine. Yeah. And it's a movie role. Oh, nice. Um, and I'm just so thankful, you yes. know. I'm um, coming on the uh, like coming off the heels of Star to be able to lock into something else. I'm I'm just really excited. Yeah. So we have to mm -hmm. You know? Yeah, of course. We're excited That's about exciting. it. Exciting, yes, yes. yes. Well, I, I gotta ask. Uh, I mean, we we all just love you. We really mm -hmm. do. You, you're gorgeous. You know that. Do you feel that sometimes, because you've been put out in the forefront uh, and well received, may I add? Thank you. Um, do you feel that you have to be this transgender role model all the time? Um, um. Well, yes, um, but it's not a burden because okay. I feel like the community has so many negative stigmas. Mm -hmm. So to be able to, uh, um, to do positive things, to be able to change people's perspectives, to be able um, to not only see because it's bigger than me. Like yes. I think that that's the thing. Like it's bigger than me. Um, what I do is not just for myself; it's mm -hmm. for my entire community. Yeah, yeah. So if I'm a role model, then. You know, like I'm thankful for that. Yes. Speaking of bigger than you, you <laughs> are doing a great partnership with Suave United We Stand yes. campaign, and we'd like to show you a little bit of it. As far as my father goes, I was named after him and his dad. I was his only, well, at the time, you know, born son, when realistically he had all daughters. You know, later we found that out. But I mean, it was just very difficult for him because. He had all these dreams and these plans in his mind and watching me grow, but I had to live my life for me. So th wow. that's gorgeous. Wow. I'm so glad mm -hmm. that you're able to tell your story. Uh, and really quickly, uh, what's your relationship like now with your father? Oh, he's my best friend on side of my mother, of course. Yeah. But we've come such a, you know what I mean, like a long way. And I think that well, things don't always have to be perfect, but mm -hmm. it's you taking the time to educate yourself yeah. when you love someone. Yeah. Um, I think that we went through, you know what I mean, so many trials and tribulations. Mm -hmm. And I mean, like, now he calls me his princess. So yes! I, think, yes. You know, I love you know, it. Like, I love it. Yeah, That's so beautiful that change. Came, that, you know, like a great amazing. Way. That's because great. You, you know, we, we hear so much about kids and teens who yeah. are struggling uh, with, with their gender and being able to, to to speak out loud the way they feel. How do you feel like your United We Stand campaign mm -hmm. is going to help these young men and women? Yeah, um, It's all about, like, representation. I mm -hmm. think to see people in certain spaces, to see people who may be considered different mm -hmm. doing things, I think that that's what's inspirational about it. Um, they decided to get a lot of... Um, like figures in the community mm -hmm. to come together and partner with different brands mm -hmm. and it's just so awesome like big frida um tommy dorfman um it's a new trans model yeah. um her name is it's erin phillip i'm mm -hmm. um, just a great group of people mm -hmm. yeah. 
I'm really, I'm really happy that your your father came around because it's so many people yeah. out there who don't have the support of their parents, mm -hmm. and that's devastating. It really is. Um, but last time you were here, you talked about you know working on your book, Memoirs yes. of, uh, yes. of a Mermaid, and it's actually out now. Yes. What will be so beautiful. <laughs> Look at that. To, to that person who yeah. may not have the support of their family, their mother, their father, or even their community. What will that individual read and be able to take away from your book, The Memoirs of a Marriott? Um, like from my book, I think that reading it, they'll see that struggle is okay. Mm -hmm. um, they'll see that change happens. They'll see, because um, I was very honest with my story. Mm -hmm. So I would hope that within reading it, because I do feel like I'm in a great place in life right now, but I didn't just want to talk about the good times. I wanted to talk about the bad times, not because uh, like I enjoyed them, but because my honesty can help someone Absolutely. else out. Yes. Yes. So seeing my struggle and seeing the highs and the lows and the triumphs, I think that that's what I hope that people take from that mm -hmm. because I, I like your dreams are possible. Yes, yes. they are. Yeah, yeah, and the, just the way the book is made, it's, nice. like, it's, it's nice. like scales on it's it. Like nice. Sure. Nice. So this is really a limited nice. edition copy, yes. and they are, like it's actually fully embossed with scales. Yes, um, they're going to be signed personally by me. Mm -hmm. uh, we also do have paperback and hardback, mm -hmm. and then I've just recently put it on Kindle mm -hmm. yes. on Amazon. Good, yes. good, good. Yes. good. You know, good. when we saw you were coming down to the circle, we always talked. We talk about like, oh my God, she's so beautiful. She's so beautiful. <laughs> so it only makes Thank sense you. that you're uh, going into the beauty industry and yes. your first item, yes. your first product is a lip gloss. Yes. Tell us more about it. Yes. Are you so, wearing it? Yes. Um, yes, I'm wearing it right oh, now. Yes. Right? Mm -hmm. um, thank you. Like I wanted to get into beauty. Like I think before Star and everything like that, my uh, like the early call to fame was like my wild hair colors mm. and my makeup and things. So I wanted to get back to my roots. So I'm starting with lip glosses first. Yes. Um, they're gonna range in colors. I have a thing for like the iridescence and mermaid colors yes. and stuff like that. Yes, yes, yes. And I'm wearing it right now. Yes. Yes. What's that? What's that Thank called? Thank you. Oh, well, it's called Prototype right now. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> But I will definitely, you know I got you. you yes, know I got yes, you. we need it. We would love that. You should name a color prototype. You should name it Sister Circle. Sister Circle. Oh, oh, like oh. Oh. Now, when you see it, uh -huh. okay, because I'm a Jew. Okay. Yeah. Oh. That's dope. I but, love it. But let me ask you this question because we were just talking the other day here on Sister Circle about having different streams of income. Yes. Mm -hmm. And you are just doing the daggone thing. Now you are an actress and an entrepreneur and an author. Or hopefully, mm -hmm. a best-selling author. We gonna claim that for you right now. Man, 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 man. So, how how do you feel like you you can maintain all of these different things and still just remain true to who you are mm -hmm. as yeah. Amaya? Um, I think that all that I'm doing is me being true to myself. Uh, yeah, we have to take time, uh, like for ourselves. But I'm trying to build a legacy. Mm -hmm. um, I'm trying to tell my story mm -hmm. as far and wide as it can go. Mm -hmm. um, I'm trying to take advantage of every opportunity. Yeah. Um, that I can, so I'll sleep later and I'll worry later. Yes, okay. yes, no. thank you. Well, we need you to get your rest. Oh, man. 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 Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for being with us today. We love your energy thank and we you. just love you. You know you can always come back yes. to the circle. Her new book, Mermaids, a Memoirs of a Mermaid, can yeah. be found where all fine books are sold and you can follow her on the gram at King Amaya Scott. Give it up for the lovely Amaya Scott.